So, I wanted to go on a rant, and uh, man, a lot of people aren't going to like this rant. Um, a lot of people don't like, don't, don't like a lot of rants I go on, probably, I mean, I, I tend to, tend to say things that <laughs> piss people off. If it's a lot of times it's the tr it's the truth, but they don't want to hear it, um, and a lot of times it's just my opinion, and they don't want to hear it, um, and I'm kind of laughing because it's like it's kind of it's kind of comical, and it's it's gonna sound it's gonna sound fucked up, but you know how I, I guess the mean way to the mean way to put it, but hey. A lot of shit I say is, is mean. I'm, I'm a mean person. You know, so... A lot of shit I say is gonna be mean. You know, um... Because at the end of the day... I realize that, like... This this world is not really... Is not a nice world. Um... And people deserve... How do I say this? I, I feel like people deserve less than you usually give them anyway. So fuck you anyway. You know, that's the only way... <laughs> Fuck it. I mean, to be real, that's just the way I'm going to just say it. You don't deserve probably half the... You probably don't deserve half of what I would give you anyway. So, fuck you anyway. You know, it's, it's like, fuck it. <laughs> it's, you know, just to be real. So, I, I, I guess I was on this... On the thought of this subject because I just see a lot of things and, um... A lot of very disgusting things, man. Um, and I guess what really what really sparked this was an incident, not an incident, but just like how I how I view certain things I see sometimes. Like I go to work and I have to catch a bus and often there will be homeless people in spot in the same spot and often the spot that these homeless people are at is the spot that I have to sit at, well, not sit, sit, stand, whatever, to, to take the bus, to wait for the bus. And, um, you know, some of these homeless people, I'm like, a couple of things really just don't sit right with me at all. Just really don't sit right with me. Um, and this is where, like, shit I talk always gets slack. You know, I always get backlash. There's always some backlash because someone doesn't like my opinion, you know? In this, this, what I'm about to say are not facts. What I'm about to say is just my straight opinion. And this is where people get all uptight and get their panties in a fucking bunch and get all mad and shit. Um, and I'm just like thinking to myself, like, okay, so you got one, you got two men. You got like one man who motherfucker is, is, is like five foot nothing. It's like, first off, you don't even hit the six foot marker. And it's like, I mean, it's already looking sad. It's just, it's already looking sad because you're like five foot, whatever the fuck you are. You're, you're short as fuck. You look like a hamster. You look like a fucking egg, like Humpty Dumpty who can't be put back together again. You're just, your appearance is already, is already fucked. You know, you, you look like you just got this like egg like appearance and it's like, bro, like, that's fine if you're comfortable in your own skin, but just, like, I'm thinking, like, what women, I don't know, who, who, like, who the fuck wants that? Like, who the fuck even, like, what gay men are even into that? I don't even know, you know what I'm saying? It's already fucked. So, but then I just have to say, like, so, I'm thinking, okay, so these motherfuckers are gonna walk around funky, dirty, always around men, these men in particular seem to always be either around men or, or young, young, like teen-esque, teen-esque to young adult males that are also homeless. And I'm thinking my first, like <laughs> my first sus suspect question is like, bro, are you just fucking gay? Like what, what the fuck's up with you? Like, you mean, tell, you got like no, what, like you have no ambition. You don't like bitches. You don't like women. Do you do, like? I, I almost it, it almost is like in my mind. I'm thinking, what horrible existence is it that? What do you do? 
walk around town in funky ass clothes all day, even when it's fucking freezing cold, looking for what? Some boys' booty, some male booties, um, maybe not in any of that at all. Maybe I don't know. Maybe you don't have erections. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. People just I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know what the fuck to think with some of these people, man. Like. Some of these people are so freaky that it's like, it'd make you wonder, I don't know, like, do you have a sex drive? I don't know, like, are you are you gay? Are you straight? I don't know what the fuck you are, but, like, I would have to say that, to me, these, these individuals seem suspect, man. Like, they seem gay as fuck, if you ask me, because it's like, you don't seem to pay women no mind, you know? Um, you know, I don't know, man. I'm thinking, like, you know... You don't even ask for, like, you ain't asked for money. You don't ask me for money. You know, it's like, I don't know, man. But but let me tell you, this. <laughs> see, people are going to get mad. Like, what? so what if they're gay? Okay, if they're gay, whatever, then they're gay. I mean, okay, but that that's your life. But I but I don't understand, like, you know, last time I checked, um, I would expect that regardless of your sexual preference, you'd want to live like a human being. And you would want just, like, better for yourself. But I don't know. If you're on a fucking another planet or some shit in your mind, you're all fucked up. You're all fucked up anyway. And, hey, that's your choice in life. But doesn't mean that I'm comfortable with that shit. Because, honestly, you make my skin crawl. You know, people like that just, just disgust me, honestly. You disgust the fuck out of me, honestly. You know, um, not saying every homeless person, but there's just a specific vibe I get from people sometimes. And it's just like... It just, it just fucks with me. I'm like, you, you just seem like, you just seem so disgusting and lowly. Like, you just seem like a, uh, like you're, like a, um, like a pest or some shit. Like a flea or, 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 or a tick or something. Like, you're just infesting the city and you're, you don't contribute nothing. You're just a fucking waste of space, taking up space. And you're disgusting. You know, and you're creepy as fuck too, man. Because you, you seem, to me it seems like you out here looking for like, uh, young males and shit, like, I'm just like, I don't know, man, but I also have to say, now, okay, when did it, when did this happen to where, like, you know, you know how you have, like, groups of, of men, because, you know, when you're, when you grow up as a man, it's like, you have sometimes a strong circle of friends, but when you have male friends, Maybe I'm getting this wrong, or maybe this is just like a weird, uh, un, what's the word, um, outdated, outdated view on life or some shit, but how I look at it, I'm, I'm looking at it like, man, you would think that as men, you know, you're strong, you're masculine, you cultivate masculine traits, and your friends around you want to be good at something, you know, it's like you, you try to pick out people who have strengths, actual strength i mean like physical strength too you know actual strength like a man's supposed to have you know and like then then you think that in your circle you think your male friends would try to and even female friends too you just think you would cultivate you would try to cultivate things that are strong and when you see like weakness so to speak of any sort inside of your circle or your ranks even to call it you would think that you try to uproot things that are weak, destroy the cause and roots of things that are weak and lazy and lethargic and, and just flat out weak. And you cut them out because they are cancerous and you, you think you try to cut them out, cultivate the strong attributes, the attributes that women would desire in a man. And then you would think that in your circle, you would thrive and, you know, you would, like, gr greatness of any sort would come out of that circle. Now, to, if that sounds far-fetched to you, then, I don't know, maybe you were raised in a different age. I was born in 1988, um, where, I don't know, man, I, I'm just going to have to say it, ha say it as it is, because <laughs> it's just, someone's going to get so mad, they're going to be like, oh, you, oh, how dare you? Well, look at this, man. What I'm really trying to say is, I don't know if it was, if it's a fucking... <laughs> If it's a fucking bisexual gene, if it's a fucking tutti fruit, I'm not even going to say what I want to say, but, you know, because I don't want to get my channel shut down, but 
I don't know if it's a gay frog, tutti fruity fucking gene or whatever the fuck has gotten into the Kool-Aid of the babies that have like come out of a certain uh, fucking age bracket or, 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 or time period. I don't know what, what fucking gay sissy ass gene is, 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 is spawning itself or, or respawning itself or whatever the fuck you want to call it. But I'm going to just say this, man. It's almost like I'm thinking, why are so many men and not just men, but like young men, why are you all fucking like bisexual, fruity ass, soft motherfuckers? Like, I don't get it. I don't really understand it. Like how did, what, what gene is going on because because i'm sorry i'm just keeping it real someone's gonna get really pissed off at me but i don't give a fuck because me it, it just, i just am what i am and, and you know i can't i can't fake fake what i am you know but like what i'm trying to say is this is um i sometimes look and i'm baffled at how like what is this whole like you know you got you got people calling themselves like bronies and shit and like what when i just don't under, <laughs> i just don't understand like how the fuck are you people even being born, number one? Because it's like, it, it's almost to me, you're like non-viable offspring. Like, I almost feel, this is going to really piss people off, but I almost feel sympathetic to fucking Nazis sometimes. And this is coming from a black man's mouth. Like, I almost feel like, what the fuck got into your gene pool, bro? Whether you're a black, Hispanic, Asian, whatever the fuck you are, mixed race, whatever you are, white... How the fuck did your genes be that fucked up? Like, how did you come out so fucked up? Like, you're weak. You got physical issues, mental issues. Your sexuality's not even right. You can't... It's like... You, <laughs> and I'm not saying right, because, I mean, you, you get what I'm really saying. Like, if you're... It's not wrong if you're gay or you're bi or whatever. But my, my, what I'm trying to say is, how come you can't seem to be good at anything? Like, you just seem weak. Like, you just seem unviable. You know? Like, you seem unviable. Like, you literally seem like you're not just the runt of the litter, but you're you're a fat, obese slob of the litter, and you seem like you can't do anything right. Like, you are literally Bobby Hill. You know who Bobby Hill is? You ever seen King of the Hill? You are a fucking loser at birth, and you're disgusting, and you're fucking weak as fuck. <laughs> and you, you just, like, I don't know how to say it in a nice way, but you are weak and you are un... What's the word? You are undesirable. You are unattractive. You are untalented. You are below average in intelligence. You are lazy. You seem to only want to sit down and play video games. You are a weak spawn of a... Sh I would say a shadow of what a man should be. You're a shadow of a human being. You are... And this is not everyone. This is I'm just talking about certain people because these people exist. You know what I mean? Like, and what I just don't understand is like, how the fuck? Like, I understand life is hard and we get dealt hard cards. But how are you so? I'm as a person. I'm not, what I'm trying to say is, how can a person be born such a way? You know? And then then what is this like explosion? I almost see of this like bisexual feminized like soft ass fruity man shit like it's like how the what the fuck it's like so you you want to sit around and like the way that you motherfuckers congregate it's like uh and and this is something i see more actually more with young with young males not not really guys my age but like guys younger especially in a certain age i'm like thinking why do you got like how do you congregate and of, of just nothing it's like literally you have no you have no uh what's the word you have no um you have no direct that's where direction you seem to have no direction you have no uh what's the word substance you have no fucking substance you are void of substance you are a, a fucking shell you are a husk you are void of substance bro you are void of substance you have no structure you have no fucking uh what's the word uh you not integrity, but you have no discipline. That's the word. You have no discipline. It's like you are you're the most sloppy, unorganized, soft motherfuckers. And it's almost like in your mind, I would say some some men, it's like you think you're masculine, but you actually can't hold a candle 
<laughs> like sadly you can't you physically can't even physically you really can't even hold like a candle to so many men and it's like thinking like how did you come out like that i don't even it's it's all it's, it's not a good like i'm not fascinated by it and definitely not in a good way but it just it it just like uh what's the word it it um it befuddles me like i'm just like i, I don't I don't know what the fuck to think at certain points. I'm just like, I don't know what the fuck, what the fuck this is, man. I don't know what the fuck I'm looking at. I don't know what I'm watching. I'm like, what the fuck is this right now? Like, what, what is this? Cause this, cause this can't be real. This shit, get <coughs> <coughs> this shit can't be real. And I would say, man, I, I feel like some of your motherfucker, uh, motherfuckers fathers must be not proud. Very sad. Because it's one thing to to see potential in a child and see that they just squander shit and they don't know how to like they're misdirected and misguided and don't know how to like it's, um, they don't know how to make something of something and they're just all fucked up. Um, but then there's some where you probably you'd be like, damn, I just what the, where the fuck did I go wrong? Like where did my where the fuck did my sperm go? Because it pro I, I don't know what the fuck's up with. Is it some is it something I ate that night? Was it? What the fuck? What the fuck's going on here? So, I I don't mean to be such a mean fucking asshole. Okay, I don't mean to be a total fucking asshole and to be a total dick. I don't want to be this, right? But I am. So I'm just gonna keep it real. There's no. I I mean, there's there comes a point in life where, like, I'm 33 years old, man. It, there comes a point in life where you just have to be real and you just can't lie. And it's like. Yeah, motherfuckers are gonna get mad. Yeah, people like aren't gonna like this. Yeah, people are gonna just just hate on me for this shit. But look, I to, why would I? Why can I? How can I lie? Okay, and I feel like this is an elephant in the room that a lot of people just don't want to deal with. It's like they want to sugarcoat it. They want <laughs> they want to say all types of shit. They really just want they don't they don't want to like speak what they're actually thinking. And I know I can't be this, the the only person thinking this. I, I know I can't, especially older generations, um, like guys who are probably in their like fifties and sixties have to be thinking this shit when they see this clownery, buffoonery and nonsense that is going on with just, and I, and I, and I'm not a father either. So, so the, the reason why I'm speaking on this is because, so I just can't see certain things for too long and not vent about it because it's just disgusting and i just have to say this man now i understand and because i'm i'm not as dumb as i seem i may seem like a dumb motherfucker but i'm really not so i understand that in nature there's natural selection and there's certain type of archetypes that will express themselves over time for certain reasons in the genes of human beings. I know how that happens, okay? I understand that process. So I know there's a place for these type of people. Like there is for anything. But I will also say that some, <laughs> some fucking time, it just really, really is, is like I'm watching something that I can't believe that I'm actually watching. And, um... I'm not, I'm not pleased with it, but I will also say this, that I accept it and I, I acknowledge its place in existence in its place in nature. And I understand it, but it still surprises the fuck out of me. And I will say this is like, I don't like to uh, surround myself with people like that. Um, it, it's just like, it, it's just so off putting too. I don't, I don't even know how to, how to describe it. It's just like, it's sickening. It's like, Cause you're just so, it's like, you just exude this weakness that like, I, I, I just, I can't, it's like, it's polar op, it's polar opposites. It's like, I can't, I can't fucking, I, I don't even know where to begin to say how I couldn't go to bed at night if I was that much of a fucking pussy and a loser. You know what I mean? Like, God damn, like literally if I was, if I was a fucking, and I've been homeless before, but if I was actual, I've, I, I think there's a difference between being homeless at a time because of circumstances and then, you know, being a fucking just straight up bum or being what I call like a career homeless person. 
Man, if I was a fucking homeless person, still, I would still rest better at night knowing that there's a stronger man inside of me than you, motherfucker, that is, 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 you know, like, what the fuck, like, what are you? God damn. It's like, you are a fucking misfit and a half, man. And I, I mean, I, I've seen, I've seen this shit with women. It's just the only reason why it doesn't stand out as women with women as much is because women have always been the supposed fairer sex already. And women are already, we already know your weaknesses. So we already, you know, as men, we already are sympathetic to that. Cause we already are, we're, we're more used to that. We're more conditioned to seeing the, the, the types of like weakness in you. You know what I mean? But when, with men, I'm like thrown way off. I'm like, I'm like thrown off, man. I'm thrown way off. Cause I'm like, well, how the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, I, I mean, I guess it, it's just like, I don't, I don't know. I also, I'm also going to say this. I'm also going to say that I understand why, that I, that, that, what, how can I say this? I understand that neither, no person is really right or wrong. It's just we all have energy and we all have like types of formats of, of, of something, you know, we're just all made a certain way. And it's not that anything's wrong with, cause you could be as fucked up as you want to be, man. I mean, you could be as weak as you want to be. You could be as soft as you want to be. You could be as, is what's the word? Um, I, 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 how do I say this? You could be as, I don't know how to say it. Like as, um, <clears throat> unviable so to speak as you want to be you know um and 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 to, it really doesn't matter because a person's value isn't really measured by my opinion it's not measured by some woman's opinion or some man's opinion or or, or, or some group it's not measured by that okay i i i'm i'm grown enough to admit that that that, that i know what, what reality really is and i'm not so i can dislike things but I'm not going to fucking bullshit myself and, and lie and say, oh, I, I'm just right because no, because because no one's really right. It's just, it's just um, when I see some shit that just fucks with me and freaks me out a lot, right? Just as much as someone was freaked out by me a lot of times because I'm a fucking walking animal and they're like, how do you look so normal? Like you look like a normal man, but you act like an actual animal. Like you're actually like a fucking, um like a monster, like, you are actually, you actually behave like a fucking animal, and I don't understand it, because you look crazy to me, I think you, you probably are crazy, you know, which, uh, it's, that's irrelevant to me, because I just exist, you know what I'm saying, I, it, like, I eat, I thrive, I take shits, hello, like, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna seek to exist, because you can't understand my fucking existence, in the same to those motherfuckers but i'm gonna say this in the world of fucking freaks to me that shit is freaky and it ain't freaky in a good way my friend this is not like freaky like kelly divine deep throat you can see kelly divine's teeth porn freaky this that's this is not a good type of freaky this is some freaky shit where it's just like bro i'm so <laughs> i'm so uncomfortable that i'm about to like dip out i'm about to get out i'm about to head out to the next room because you motherfuckers are, are, are just, are, 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 are triggering me, bro. <laughs> I hate, I hate to say it, but I'm now triggered. I am triggered, bro. I am fucking freaked out and triggered by this shit. Because I'm like, I can't, I, nah, this is not, like, this is, this, this just can't, it just can't be. It's like, how are you gonna, like, like, how, how are you gonna take, uh, how are you gonna take fucking uh what's the word um solace in 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 just like being a certain way like how are you i don't understand understand how you look how you look at yourself in the <laughs> in the mirror i don't understand how you don't fucking kill yourself you don't want to killed yourself already some of you people i'm just keeping it real man like i don't even understand what type of miserable existence keeps you al <laughs> keeps you alive like like what damn god allows your ass to fucking breathe and i'm serious man like you, you talking about some motherfuckers like 
you know, you don't want any, you don't want any money. Like, like, damn, like, you know, um, you know, all I hear you talk about, and I'm talking about some homeless people that I don't even know, I don't even know their names and shit. It's just like, you know, you hear people say shit, like they talk to each other. So you overhear shit all the time. You see shit day and day. You see people in the same place in the same time. I'm thinking like, man, I may not know shit, but in my, in my little like fucked up imagination and fucked up brain, I'm thinking y'all motherfuckers are out here trying to smoke, trying to get high. And you're ain't even chasing no woman's tail. You you're probably chasing some fucking male booty. And then at the same time, <clears throat> you gay ass motherfuckers. And then at the same the same time, it's like, what type of man are you chasing? Like, are you chasing? Like, are you are you like uh, you know, because you you're the types to to hang around like young like like so. <laughs> So I let me, let's keep it hardcore and real. Is this some pedo shit? Like, is this some, like, what the fuck? Like, of course, like, I'll put, I'll put it to you like this. Of course, I'd be angered if a homeless motherfucker tries to talk to me on some gay ass shit. Like, like, you want to, you want to look at me because you think I'm a handsome black man and I'm not down with none of that shit. And, but at least my mind is a little bit more sympathetic that, like, yes, you're a fucking retard for thinking that any way, shape, or form, I'd be down with that gay ass shit, number one. Number two, you're dumb as fuck and you're crazy as astronomically to think that even if I was gay, that a stinky, ugly, weird-looking little motherfucker like you, that is five foot whatever the fuck you are, that I would ever even look at you twice if I was gay. And then also, I may have to add... I'll say it again, you stinky little motherfucker, you need to, like, what, like, <clears throat> there's a thing called showers, too, man, I mean, just, just as a human being, you know, you, it, it just, the whole thing is fucked, man, and then, but what really, what bugs me is, if, when I see motherfuckers looking at, like, young fucking, um, young, young boys, or, young, you know, it's like, I'm like, <laughs> so, so, fucking, so it's like, is there a pedal layer? Is there literally a pedal sauce pedal layer to this shit? I mean, you just can't get any more. It's almost like I said, man, you just can't with certain things. You just can't get any more fucked with it. And the fuckery has hit a, le a, a level of now this has become like, I would literally exterminate you. Like if I had the means, I may go on a witch hunt and I would literally have you exter either, either you're either, I'll put it like this. Either you're getting shipped out in a box or you're getting shipped out in a box. Read between the lines. Cause that's how I get down. I don't give a fuck. I'm a straight G. I don't give a fuck. Either you, either you get shipped out in a box with holes in it. You feel me? You get, you get shipped out with, with a box with holes in it. Like go to, I'll ship you to Africa. I'll ship you to Asia. I'll ship you to India. I'll ship you somewhere. I, maybe I'll be nice to ship you somewhere if you're white where people look like you. So I'll, maybe I'll ship you to Germany or some shit. But look here, motherfucker. Either one way, you're leaving. You're leaving in a fucking box. Because if you stay here, you're leaving in a fucking box, bro. Read between the lines. Read between the lines. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> some people don't like that shit. They'll say, oh, what that's the, that's harsh harsh my ass motherfucker power is harsh if you have enough power you can do anything the fuck you want D don't let people lie to you if you have enough money enough power and enough uh enough weapons you could do you could do whatever the fuck you want and if i say that you're, you're gonna leave oh all of you motherfuckers are gonna leave you, the city will be cleaned up so i'm just saying that like this is raw, this is uncut, this is the real deal, this is G shit, this is the, the real shit, this is my actual thoughts, because we, we, people, a lot of us, we think like this, it's just motherfuckers or pussies and they won't say this shit, they're like, well, I don't want to seem like a monster, well, you are a fucking monster, we are monsters, the fuck, we all are monsters, it's just, I'm just saying my, my thoughts, because man, I, I just see too much shit that's just like, I'm like, God damn, now I know what some of you racist motherfuckers feel like when you see me. It's like, you're just, just disgusted. You're just like, damn, I wish you'd get out of my fucking city. Like, I wish you just, just vamoose, man. 
because you're just fucking it all up. So some people say, oh, well, who are you really talking about? Are you talking about the age of the, fr- <laughs> of the, <laughs> are you talking about the age of the bisexual tutti fruity boys that are supposed to be young men, but they are so fucked up that they'd come out like bronies and shit and special little snowflakes. And now nah, I'm not, I'm not so much talking about them. Now, th- those motherfuckers, to me, just seem, like, disgusting because they are weak and they are underachievers, and there's a weakness in them that, g- generally, in me, certain weaknesses, because, see, the, the good thing about me, I, I don't suffer from any of those type of weaknesses, okay? I'm not bisexual, I'm not gay, and I'm by no means fucking soft, okay? So... I don't struggle with those type of weaknesses as a man, nor any type of being, or I don't, I don't have that. But what I'm saying, my point is the complacency in someone who does have those things, it appalls me because I'm thinking like, how the fuck would you, because I'll even be real. If if that shit was even like my son or some shit, I mean, obviously at the end of the day, I'd accept them for who they are. But it would, be, it would be a hard pill to swallow because just generally, and I'm speaking, this is real shit. People, some people are pussies. They don't even want to say, I'm, I'm keeping it real. I don't, I wouldn't want no child of mine weak like that. Like, what the fuck are you? Like, I did not, I did not bring you into this world for you to be that and to be weak like that. that like, if you're that fucking weak, then you know, that's just, that's not good, that, that's not, no, we never, it's, it's kind of like, for instance, when a baby is born, you want your baby to have all of its fingers and toes, you know what I'm saying, you don't, you, you wouldn't, you don't say, oh yeah, I want my baby to be fucked up, and I want it to have, like, no, no one's, no one's rooting for that, okay, <laughs> unless you're, unless your baby's born a Ninja Turtle, and he just happens to have, like, three, actual really good functioning strong ass fingers like Goro or some shit then that's all good you know if you want to bring in like different things into the species that actually would make it stronger then you know that that that's actually a good thing but that's sci-fi that ain't reality I ain't never seen a baby with a Goro hand that has three fingers on it but those fingers are like could crush your fucking skull now that would be a gift not a not a curse you know what I'm saying get my point it's like I'm just saying, man, (coughs) the shit I see fucks with me, but, (coughs) but this is what, (coughs) this is how I take it, right? I take it, I take it like, but, but, oh, now I have to also say now that, that whole, that pedo shit. Okay. This is where now I'm drawing the line there. Cause, cause like, I'm sorry. I just have a certain type of way that I, I am as a person. And if you're on some fucking pedophile, creepy ass shit like that, man, I gotta say, to, to, in my in my opinion, like this, man, <laughs> this is gonna sound really fucked up and really harsh and mean, but I look at it like you're two steps from a fucking box, and I'm not gonna say that I wouldn't like to put you in a fucking box, because it's just, to me that's just that's just disgusting. It's like, and then. Your contentment, this is where the Nazi comes out in me. Yeah, I said I said it at the end where <laughs> the other end where this is where like obviously I'm not a Nazi, obviously, but you get what I'm saying. This is this is where that 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 crazed mad dog Nazi mentality starts to come out. If you are it's like if you are so content in being dirty, funky, stinky, nasty, no job, and then on top of that, you want to sit around. And you don't even have like dreams or aspirations, like you your aspirations are to get up in some young boy's booty hole or something. Man, you're lucky I don't fucking. Like I said, man, you're lucky I don't go on a fucking crazed witch hunt and and, and just have you have you fucking exterminated, motherfucker. Now someone shit their pants or someone got up tight. Do you, you got up tight with the panties, your panties out in a twist, or maybe you just shit yourself because maybe that's you or something. You know, I don't know. But I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna say this, <coughs> and, I'm, and I'm cutting it here. And I'm cutting it here because this is my fucking channel. Say whatever the fuck I want on this channel. I'm cutting it right here. If you don't like it, then get the fuck off my channel first off. If you don't like it, 
you could go kick rocks, bitch. Fuck. And then second off, to the people who actually watch this channel and actually, er, 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 uh, what's the word, um, sound minded enough to actually just like get what I'm actually really saying and you realize, okay, this is just his opinion. Well then, you know, my props to those people like that, that are actually more intelligent and don't get too, you know, get too confused and lost and lost in yourself, lost in everything. You just, you just lose all around, man. So this has been a buck wild, crazy rant. This has been a really mean rant. I, I, I'll admit that this has been a mean, mean as fuck rant. But you know what? If it made someone actually think and they actually prioritize what they hold value in, or even someone said, you know what? Um, like my friends aren't we? we they don't they don't contribute to any any uh positive success of um growth in anything I do. They don't do anything. They're nobodies. Um, they're content in all types of negative things. Fuck them. Well, then that's a positive, man. And if even that, if even that could come out of this, well, then I'll be glad to take all the backlash that I know, already know, I'll be getting off of this type of rant. But this is the real fucking deal, okay? So, it is what it is. This is Steve's Art and Fun Channel. This is in Rants. And uh, I hope you enjoy this, like... We this lighting, uh, this, this like uh, I, don't, I what do I I don't know what I call this lighting, but it's it's this very weird <coughs> type of lighting. I usually do this when I'm like in bed or something. Um, I don't know. I guess it it it, it gives an effect that I feel gives a point like a point across and jars people. So uh, you know I can't say any more. You know, except I I appreciate all the views, all the subscribers. All the people who are not soft ass pussies who haven't forgotten what it means to be a, a man, but of all things, just to be a, a human being, like, because people just don't understand what anything means anymore, don't know what to value anymore. Um, so that's the rant, and uh, have a nice day.